I had someone reach out to me yesterday. He said, you know, LinkedIn video is dead. It's just dead. He's like, I only had so many people. I'm done. <laughs> he's, like, he's like, I only had so many people view it. I was like, well, how many do you need to view it for the video to be a success? Great question. The answer is one for most people, right? If one person sees it, who's the right person and they become a client, it's a great video. On the other hand, you could have a million people see it who aren't the right people, who aren't interested in doing business with you, who have no desire to move forward to have a conversation with you, was the video a success? So, I th but I think we're all hooked to the dopamine. This is amazing, like, and I'm gonna share this and I do not mean this to sound in any way pretentious, braggadocious, or like in any way like that. But I have to say this, and, and you can probably understand and relate. Do you know how many thousands of dollars I have made from folks who have never engaged in my content but referenced it to me after the fact? I would say most of the clients that we have got from LinkedIn specifically, I had no idea that they were following the content. Never liked anything, never commented on it. All of a sudden they just showed up on my calendar because they scheduled an appointment. So you never know in real time. I love the people who give love. That makes me the happiest. That's so great. Like, I thank you. Like, thank you for me putting something out and thank you for commenting on it and liking it or engaging with it, giving me a pat on the back, telling me it's cool. Like, I love that. Thank you. I will never not love that. That's that's friendly and I enjoy it. But to sit here and pretend that others don't see it, but get value from it is the most ludicrous, wild thing I've ever heard in my life. Like, do you forget that we used to put ads in the yellow pages and you couldn't track <laughs> how many people looked at know my plan on page 332 yeah you know what would be a, uh, an amazing social experiment is if for like one week all of the social platforms took away the ability to see how many people like shared something oh dude more than a week um, give it a month it would be so clean and sanitized because everyone would disappear <laughs> they're not getting that dopamine hit right there's, there's no reason to show up <laughs> But, you know, a lot of my, I mean, most of my stuff that I put on LinkedIn or any of the social platforms don't do well by any sort of modern day metrics. You know, I've never had anything that's gone viral and had hundreds of thousands of views or anything like that. You know, maybe if something had 5,000 views to me, that would be viral um, in 2024 Nick Nielsen land, but it doesn't matter. It just doesn't matter. Like, is, I, I, I just feel it's about consistency, sharing to the world a little bit about yourself, sharing with the world a little bit about how you work with people and some of the questions they solve or you solve. And you just want to be in the mix when the people have the pain point of the, you know, the two or three things. I, I just think that so many advisors and how you deal with this, they get so wound up about these about these metrics. I'm really, sh I, I'm, I'm over it now, I, but I did have a moment of like, of like, I was stuck and I was like, I trust these guys. Like I, they're good people, right? I'm, I'm having conversations with people, their clients, they're good people, good families, like good humans. And I'm like, I trust you. And I, I think your clients trust you and like, you're doing really good. You explain to people in a, in a terrific fashion of how to like, it's not time timing the market it's time in the market like ignore the noise like let's build this over the next 25 years like let's do this thing long term and get you set up and like i believe in it the most and they do too and their clients do too and then i'm like all right let's talk marketing and then they're well this didn't do well this didn't do well i didn't get any reaction on this this isn't doing this and i'm like how are you so long term patient over here and you're day trading on the and other side <laughs> i is literally like i'd go upstairs and like get a coffee my wife and talking like honey i don't understand like it's almost like jekyll and hyde sometimes